Hey guys, what's up? Pokemon Naruto DBZ1 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get Siri on your non-supported device. That is iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, iPad 2, and, I, and iPod Touch 4th generation. Um, yes, I did make a video like this um, earlier, but for some odd reason, the Siri port, you know, just went offline one day, as you can see here. This is the Siri port server status website. It's just offline. I don't, I don't know what happened. I don't know if it's going to be back, so I'm making this video. For those of you who don't know how to get um, the Siri GUI, I mean, the, for the people who didn't watch my old video, I'm going to show it to you guys again. Let's go ahead and open up Cydia. And add this repository. Um, iHackStore.com HTTP forward slash forward slash iHackStore.com forward slash repo forward slash I will have the link in the description below. So once you get that repo, just go ahead and open it up. Scroll down to S until you get the Siri tweaks. Now, if you're on iOS 6.1 for iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, and iPhone 4G, go ahead and get iOS Siri for iOS 6.1. If you're on iOS 6.1.2 on uh, iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, and iPhone 4G, go ahead and get Siri for iOS 6.1.2. However, if you are on an iPad, um, you guys are going to have to get Siri for iOS 6. Siri iPad for iOS 6.1. Um, over here, and if you're on 6.1.2, you're gonna have to get Siri for iPad 6.1.2, which I do have installed on my iPad right now. So go ahead and go there and just install it by pressing this button right here. It will take a little while to uh, install, and when you reboot it, it might seem like it's gonna freeze, but this is not Acid Siri, people. It's not gonna freeze like Acid Siri. So once you get that installed, reboot your device, and go back to Cydia, go to Sources, and then you guys gotta enter this source right here. Techwick repo, http colon forward slash forward slash apt.techwick.com forward slash. So once you go to the repo, go ahead and get it. Um, and look for PAT setup for iOS 6. This one, PAT setup for iOS 6. Um, whatever device you're on, whatever firmware you're on, I mean, uh, whatever iOS 6 version you are on, I mean like 6.1, 6.1.1, and 6.1.2, go ahead and get PAT set up for iOS 6. And this will not take installation, I mean, this won't, it won't take that much installation time. Um, it's just 11 KB, so just get that, respring your device, and then navigate over to settings. Um, go to right here Siri DR settings which you're gonna get and make sure this is entered in https colon forward slash forward slash connect dot uh, p, uh, p a t assistant dot com all right make sure you get that and then go to the pat server tab which you will just get right here which is right above the Siri DR settings tab and make sure that it is enabled. All right, once that's enabled, you should be good to go. You don't need to respring like the last method. Props to PAT server for making it this simple and you know easy to connect. And Hi Siri. Hello, Jaden. Help. What do you want to do? All right, as you can see here, Siri um, on your iPad, if you say help, it can show you all the commands it can do. Let me just, you know, zoom in and show you guys that. Siri can find out the time, find out the weather forecast, post something to Facebook, post something to Twitter, find your location, place a fate, place a call, place a FaceTime call, send a message, read a new message, um, display an image, um, you know, and it has lots more commands which you guys can try out on your own. This is PAT Siri. Yeah, as I said, um, so props to the creators of PAT Siri, you guys are helping us out a lot. So until then, this is Pokemon Naruto DBZ1, signing out.